subscribe. Click on the bell. Like, comment, share. These are the glasses that we normally see and used. These glasses are made to serve different purposes. Some are used for decoration. Some are used as containers. Some are used for measurement. And some are used to withstand heat and chemical reaction. To us, glass is not more than a solid material that is clear or translucent and comes in different colors and shapes. But come to think of it, can the same glass be made to serve different purposes? Glass is an amorphous solid or non-crystalline solid. It is one of the most versatile substances because it can be used in many applications and in a wide variety of forms. The essential ingredients used in glass making are sand, silica or silica dioxide and metallic oxide such as calcium oxide or sodium oxide. The mixture is strongly heated to produce silicate salts which is glass. Different types of glass can be made from different composition of sand or silica and other metallic oxide. Click on the photo to view different types of glass and their properties. The most common type of glass is soda lime glass. Soda lime glass composed of 60 to 80% silicon dioxide, 15% sodium oxide and 10% sodium carbonate. A low percentage of other materials can be added for a desired characteristic. Soda lime glass has relatively low melting point of 700 degrees Celsius. It is less resistant to heat and may break easily. Soda lime glass has a good chemical durability and resistant to chemical attack from aqueous solutions so they will not contaminate the contents inside or affect the taste. Soda lime glass is used to make flat glass, window panes, electrical bulbs, mirrors and glass containers. Borosilicate glass is known as Perex. This is an expensive glass because various other elements are added to give it its excellent qualities. It is mainly made up of 70 to 80% silica and 7 to 13% boron oxide with smaller quantities of the alkalis and aluminium oxide. This glass is heat resistant and does not crack with any sudden temperature change. This type of glass has a relatively low alkali content compared to soda lime glass. It also has a good chemical durability. Its greater thermal shock resistance makes it suitable for domestic kitchens. Borosilicate glass is also used in the laboratories due to its accuracy and durability in temperature-related experiments. Fused glass is also known as quartz glass. Fused glass is made of 99% silica. It is heated until it melts at 1700 degrees Celsius and then cooled immediately. Thus, this makes it difficult to melt or mold it into shapes. This glass is very resistant to heat. It does not crack with sudden temperature change. This type of glass has a relatively low alkali content compared to soda lime glass and has a good chemical durability. Due to its greater ability to withstand temperature changes and a higher resistance to thermal shock, it is used for domestic kitchens and chemistry laboratories. It gives greater accuracy for laboratory measurement in temperature-related experiments. Using recent technology, it is possible to mold, slump and draw it into fibre, tube and rod shapes. These are lead crystal glasses. Any glass containing at least 24% of lead to oxide can be described as lead crystal. This glass is made of 60 to 80% silica and to 30% of lead 2 oxide. Lead crystal glass has a high density and refractive index. Compared to borosilicate glass, lead crystal glass surface is soft for grinding, cutting and engraving. Lead crystal glass has low melting point of approximately 600 degrees Celsius as compared to soda lime which has 700 degrees Celsius melting point. 
lead crystal glass can be crafted into fine tableware and art objects. Apart from that, its optic transparency and content of lead makes it suitable to be made into fine crystal. The table shows the four types of glass and their properties. Study the examples of glass products shown. For each of the products, determine the type of glass it is made of. Drag and drop the glass product into appropriate space provided. In this lesson, we have learned that Glass is a very useful manufactured substance because of its transparent properties. Its many uses depend on the properties of the glasses. The table shows the composition and uses of the various types of glasses. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video. And don't forget to subscribe.